back and back. I can't even get my fucking words. It just tastes so good. Take two. Welcome back to another video. Your girl did it again. She went to another charity shop when I said I wasn't going to because my bank balance. Even though the price is amazing, it does still add up. Um, but yeah, my bank account does not love me at the minute. But yeah, I went to another charity shop. I kind of did it to myself. I thought, oh, I'm going to go for some, like, tea and coffee um, with some of my friends and do some work and we decided to meet here, meet up in Charlton and I know there's a very good charity shop in Charlton so it would have been rude not to go so we went and I dragged Jess along with me as well and I think she kind of hates me too now because we walked out with bags full like bags full anyway I'm going to stop talking because this is going to be a very long haul because I've got a mixture of things, so I've got a few pieces from other charity shops that I've been to. So yeah, let's just get into this because we're going to be here a while. First thing I picked up was, I've got all my little coat on it. Actually, would it be better to, I don't know, I'll take it off. Is this like high neck, turtleneck, beige jumper, kind of ribbed effect at the bottom. Um, and on the top and down the front as well actually I didn't notice that it's also got a little gold tag there so we can tell that this was actually from River Island and the tag is still in the bottom I've obviously crossed it out where it says River Island and I this was from a charity shop called New Life it was 10.99 However, it had 75% off that price as well. So it was actually only like £3. So that was the first thing that I did pick up. Absolutely love it. it keeps me so warm. And I feel like these tones and colours are so in at the minute. So that was an absolute bargain. Sticking to jumpers as well. I actually picked up this oversized jumper with a shirt inside. Um, the shirt is not detachable, so it's just the style of the jumper. It's also got it at the bottom as well. This is quite a long one, so you could definitely wear this without trousers, or you could just wear it with um, some leather trousers. Again, absolutely love it. Um, this was from New Life, and it was £8.99, but again, it had 75% off, so whatever that is. It was very cheap anyway. And... I don't actually know if I can see, and this is also from River Island, I can see it there. So that was also from River Island. And I feel like the material um, is definitely going to keep you warm. It's very thick. So yeah, lovely piece. Um, and I just think these are actually really in at the minute. So to find that, normally it's like last season's um, stock that they send to the charity shop. But for some reason, it looked like this season's stock. Unless these are in last year, I actually don't know, I can't remember, but anyway, they are definitely in at the minute, so that was another good little find. Oh my god, this was an absolute bargain. I I know this was last season's, I do, because I remember wanting it, um, but not, I didn't want to pay the price of it. And, oh god, how much did I pay for this? It was so cheap, because the zip is actually broke on it. But it's fine because I can get a zip put on. It's so easy. And to be honest, I don't think I'd wear it zipped up. So it doesn't really matter. It doesn't concern me. But anyway, it's this jacket. I just feel like it's such a classy jacket to wear. I don't know where I'm going to wear it. But it just gives me like Christmas market vibes. It's obviously got the fur collar at the top. It is from River Island. And I paid... 6 99 for this, £7, what the hell? And to be honest, the zip is still on there, so um, I think that's going to be easy to... It might just, it might zip up, I don't know. We'll see on the try-on bits anyway. Um, and yeah, 
it does give me like a winter vibe like Christmassy. I don't know what I'm going to wear it with yet but I'm sure we'll find something so that was really really cheap quality is obviously amazing because it's River Island their jackets are always amazing but I always find they are really expensive so god knows how much this would have been definitely over £60 and I paid £7 for it honestly you just need to know where to look and to be honest sometimes it is the look of the draw so I needed an oversized shirt for so long <laughs> I actually um was gonna pinch my boyfriend's and I was actually gonna pinch my granddad's to be honest because he has so many shirts that he just doesn't need and they're definitely oversized so why not no one would know well you do now because I said to YouTube but anyway no um it's like the pullovers as well you know the pullover vests my granddad's got loads of them and he's gonna find them all out for me for me to have because he doesn't wear them anymore and they're the fashion now so you know anyway to save a bit of money but anyway yeah i picked up this shirt that. so it's just a classic white oversized shirt it has got these gold detailed buttons which i really love i think one is actually missing you know um but it's okay because i think i have tried this on before and it's actually fair yeah and oh god how much should i pay for this seven pounds to pay for this shirt i paid the same price for the shirt as the jacket <laughs> But if I'd have got this in River Island, then I probably would have been looking at like £25, I reckon. And yeah, you can't be an oversized shirt in your wardrobe. And I just think, yeah. What I love about oversized shirts as well is they can just... You can have them both like in your wardrobe in the summer season and in the winter season. So they're just so easy to style. Like I love wearing oversized shirts in the summer and I love wearing as much in the winter. You need a basic oversized shirt in your wardrobe. But yeah, so that's actually, yeah, that's from River Island as well. And £6.99. This, oh my God. I'm back again with another jacket. I love this jacket so, so much. Oh. And it's basically like this. It's not a teddy bear, um, I don't know, I don't know what material it is, it's really really soft but it is like this, it's cropped, it's got like little drawstrings here where you can pinch it in, um, again this was from River Island and I paid, oh my god it was so cheap because it had 75% off as well, I honestly think I paid about £4 for this, I'm, I'm, I'm adamant I did yeah, it was so cheap I remember um and yeah it's so so warm it feels so thick the quality is absolutely amazing and again i feel like you would be paying a lot of money for this in river island like just look at that how fluffy it is oh, i want to sleep in it so yeah that was the other jacket that i managed to find honestly my only problem is with this like would you call it an addiction oh, I definitely would call it an addiction I have nowhere to store these items my boot is full of clothes my granddad's shed is full of clothes my wardrobe you can't get any more in it and I'm not having a repeat of my under the bed again because that was just a nightmare and they just no I don't want to neglect my clothes like that because I just don't wear them if they go under that bed they're staying there forever so yeah i think i might have to buy one of them clothes rails but then i don't know where to put it oh this room is so big but it's not maybe it's just me being over dramatic because people are like oh my god you've got so much storage like, obviously i've got all under my bed my wardrobe is quite a big wardrobe but yeah it just doesn't it really doesn't cut it for me not at all anyway I thought I would throw this one in as I did get this from um, a charity shop as well but you'd have already seen me wear this because I do rinse the life out of it <laughs> because I just love it so much but it is this oversized leather jacket and what I just love about this is the gold like the gold and black buttons I just think they're so like just classic and trendy I love it it's got some big pockets there as well um, the only problem with this is 
it gets me thinking sometimes i'm like do i smell a fish and then i realize it's this jacket so yeah that's the only problem with it maybe i just need to try wash it again and see if the smell goes it's not awful but generally just get that slight whiff anyway absolutely love this i paid 12 pounds for this um and again from new life i just had to pick it up if i'm honest with you because it's not my size it's a size 14 but it's better oversized anyway and i'm so glad i because i was so close to not picking it up and it's too big for you it's too big for you and i was like mm. and then i just thought you know what i'm just gonna get it because in the shop you couldn't try it on because obviously covid and stuff and i just thought you know what i'm gonna get it so i'm so glad i did um and i actually love it i literally live in it so imagine if i didn't pick it up so that is everything that is from new life which is <sighs> new life is a charity shop back in my hometown so i actually got these quite a while ago i think i got them about or two months ago so and they've just been in my wardrobe waiting to do a video on it um, and i just thought i might as well include them in the pieces that i got yesterday but yeah new life is like a charity for children i believe and um, basically like ted baker river island um i can't remember many others i think there's definitely others i think top shop definitely yeah top shop as well they will donate their things to their like their last season stock so there is one in Cannock. um so yeah definitely take a trip there there is a new outlet being built right next to it that's got like it's another vista village or cheshire oaks so always check that charity shop out if you're heading up there for anyone who's watching this and they're like miles away moving on to the things i got yesterday i went in and said to myself you can have one item and i want some leather trousers fine no that weren't happening 10 minutes later i could not hold my things jess was having to put things behind the counter because we just couldn't carry any more oh, honestly but it's all for you guys oh i've missed one item sorry it fell down um sorry i actually also got this one from new life as well i just proper love this obviously you can only wear it on a wednesday but it's also this high neck cropped um pink jumper and it just says on wednesdays we wear pink i just feel like this is so cute to just style under a leather jacket or even with just some jeans the light blue jeans or any color jeans really i just think it's such a basic um high neck but it adds so much style at the same time i do absolutely love this it goes so nice under leather honest to god but yeah so i also got that that was 4.99 and yeah that was the another thing that i did pick up i can't actually remember where this is from um quite a few people messaged me because i wore this on i put a picture on my instagram and quite a few people messaged me where it was from but i just couldn't find where it is from i tried river island and um, so it must have just been discontinued and i can't even find anything similar so god no i just have no idea i can't help you we'll move on so these items are all from the british heart foundation in charlton and the first thing i did pick up was this body warmer oh wow is it like a, how do you say it a gillet a gillet a gillet i don't know i'm saying that completely wrong but you know what i mean anyway it's this beige you know what got a little pocket there and you can actually fasten that so that's handy and yeah i kind of just love this i feel like this goes so nice with like a beige um high neck or like a black um turtleneck or whatever and this was jesus i didn't realize i've paid that much for it. well i haven't paid that much for it but um yeah that was actually 9.99 but again it's really thick it's definitely going to keep me warm so there we go um and it again is from pretty little thing it looks like it is a sample item because it doesn't have the pretty little thing in the tag just yet but it does say that it's from pretty little thing it's actually pretty little thing must get their clothes from this company because then on that just say pretty little thing so maybe check out that company before you check out pretty little thing i don't know anyway yeah obsessed with this i feel like it is definitely the right kind of outfit for this season well 
like kind of body warmer to call it. I don't even know how to say the other word. The, the theme of body warmer slash gillette. Gillette? Okay. I don't know. Anyway, I picked this one up in black. So the shoulder pads actually come a little bit over more on this one. And yeah, it's just in this black colour. It's got two pockets. And again, I just feel like this is going to be so nice with a turtleneck, a beige, any colour really because it's black. And I just feel like it goes so nice in this season. Um, defo, perfect for when you don't want to throw a jacket on, but it is cold outside. <laughs> anyway, I paid, how much did I pay for this one? Yeah, so I paid 5 99 for this one. This is actually still on the Pretty Little Thing website. So it's actually £22 on the Pretty Little Thing website. So that's a really good saving. And yeah, so obviously I already said I went in for some leather trousers. I managed to find them. And I managed to get these ones. They've got a bit of a pattern on the knee. I have not yet. Hopefully these do fit. I did get them. They're in a size 10 and these are actually from Topshop. Paid £4.99 for those. The quality does feel really, really nice to be honest. I feel like they're going to be absolutely fine but yeah that was what i was looking for because i'm desperately in need of a pair of new leather trousers i have got some but they've got like buckles at the side and i just need a plain pair i've got like jogger leathers but anyway pick those up um yeah 4.99 i think i need to start my own business i was literally saying this to jess like i just feel like I could thrift for everyone and like thrift for people based on their preferences, their needs, their sizes obviously and then send them my whole outfit for like dirt cheap like whatever it costs me plus a little bit more for posters like honestly I would love that I would honestly, I honestly would love that I don't even know how to start with that one though the item I did pick up was a bodysuit and obviously this will go perfect under those body warmers and I just got a high neck black plain well it's not plain it's got the zip detail here which goes all the way to the top and I pick this up for $4.99 again it's like a really tight material so I feel like it's going to be quite like suck me in which is what we want and yeah you really can't go wrong this pile is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger favorite out of everything i've actually been wanting some of these for a while there's some really nice nike ones and i was gonna buy them but i think they're about 50 pounds on asos so anyway it is these i don't know how you'd say it, they're like wide leg joggers but then like they're really wide leg you'll see better on the try on but yeah, they've kind of got this little pleat detail here as well. And I paid 5 99 for those. I feel like they're going to be so, so comfy and just pairing them with a chunky trainer or even with them body warmers. I just feel like it's going to be such a nice outfit. I'm so excited to wear these. These are definitely, actually, maybe the next thing is going to be my favourite. Who knows? So yeah, that's those. I just hope, actually, they might be really long. We'll just have to see. We'll have to have a really chunky trainer. <laughs> I then picked up some sparkling shorts. Why did I say it in that accent? Then? Um, yeah, so I picked up these kind of like tie dye cycling shorts. Um, I actually got some similar to these, like in a pinky and like pale pink colours on Molly May's collection. And um, these look exactly the same, just a different like tones of colours. Um, but yeah, I just feel like these are just your everyday cycling shorts. You can just chill in them or you can style them up, whichever. But I do like the colours. So I decided to pick these up and these were 2 99 And they've still got obviously the pretty little thing tag on there. So yeah, they are in a size 8 though, but I'm a little bit worried. Jess might have to have them. Just because the material is the ones I bought on my last haul. And they were quite tight, so these... These might be a bit too tight. Like I could have probably sized up in the 10. So the 8 might be pushing it. We'll see. 
Now we are finally on to the last thing, which is a bag, of course. It would be rude not to, because every time I go into the shop, I always have beautiful bags. And this bag I actually saw on Pretty Little Thing quite a while ago. And I was like, oh, I really, really like it. But then I think it was about £25, and I just couldn't justify £25 on a little bag. I mean, I know that's not too expensive, but for me it is. Anyway, I'm so glad I didn't because I found it in this charity shop. How crazy is that? But it's just this little like clutch, but it's got this chain, and um, so you could easily wear it over the shoulder. I just I'm obsessed with these bags because I just feel like you could wear the most basic outfit, and then this bag will just style it all up for you. Like just this with a black dress would just do me. So simple, I love it. Anyway, it is actually gorgeous. Like I'll do a bit of a close up, but how stunning is that oh it's so gorgeous and again it's like the right size amount of room that you want to just hold any change phone blah 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 and how much did i pay for this 4.99 what 4.99 that is crazy I'm actually obsessed. What the hell? My camera just died. Like, it didn't, didn't die, obviously, because I'm still on it. It just cut off because it cuts off after 17 minutes, I think. But I was just saying that is the end of the haul, and it cut off, and I was like, Ooh, perfect timing, girl. Um, yeah, anyway, that is the end of the haul. Altogether, I spent £39 on all the things on the British Heart Foundation, Foundation, so what I bought yesterday. Um, obviously all together god knows how much i spent but yeah there we go with another haul um don't get me wrong i think you'll be getting another one real soon because this is literally just what i love like i, I do need to start a business doing this i swear to god but yeah anyway um i hope you all enjoyed this and i'll see you very soon for a new video bye